are you looking to soundproof a room? The first step is to understand what sound blocking means, and that sound blocking is very different from sound absorption. To begin, I have to introduce some light physics here. Sound transmitting through a wall is actually energy. It vibrates through common surfaces, whether it's concrete, wood floors, or drywall. To completely stop a sound wave, the barrier has to be wider than the length of the wave. Notice how the high frequency waves of the singing are shorter than the width of the wall. This makes it hard for these waves to pass through. On the other hand, the low frequency waves of the guitar are much wider, making low frequencies the most difficult to soundproof. Sound blocking, or sound isolation, involves stopping sound waves from passing into areas where they aren't wanted. The key to stopping sounds from traveling through walls, ceilings, and floors is adding mass, which generally means building thicker walls and suspended floors and ceilings with heavier materials. Many sound barrier products are available on the market today. Each material is usually STC rated. The STC is a rating of how well a material or assembly blocks sound. The higher the STC rating, the more effective the barrier. Audimute's Peacemaker Sound Insulation is an excellent sound barrier that can be used to add mass. Peacemaker is typically installed during the initial construction or renovation of the space. The product is available in various thicknesses and densities, each appropriate for different sound blocking situations. 6.4 mm Peacemaker, for example, is specifically designed to reduce structural noise and vibrations produced by lower frequencies. If you would like to discuss your project, give us a call or visit audimutesoundproofing.com. Let us put our knowledge to work for you.